do you have a little extra fat on your body? Possibly around your waistline that you'd like to get rid of? Or are you just interested during the holidays of maintaining your weight and focusing on not gaining? Well, we have different workshops that we can help provide information to you about how to maintain your weight and how to manage your weight loss goals and things to work on. So this is only five pounds of fat. It might look like a, a lot more, but this is what it looks like. And this is what you're carrying on your bones and your joints. So if you're carrying an extra 15, 20 pounds, you have three to four of these on your body. And it's a lot of times they're around our waistline, especially if we tend to be more of an apple shaped. And unfortunately, that fat is sitting around your most important and vital organs. And it can cause a lot of health problems, whether diabetes, heart disease, asthma, or even certain types of cancer. So the Extension Office is providing information this holiday season to help you maintain your weight or even manage your weight loss goals. One of the ways that we're gonna be doing that is pushing for the Eat Smart, Move More Weight Loss Annual Holiday Challenge. It's actually called Maintain, Don't Gain. So instead of focusing on losing weight during the holidays, which is extremely difficult, we want you just to focus on maintaining your weight. Each week when you sign up for this holiday campaign, you get newsletters provided to you from the North Carolina Eat Smart Move More program. They also provide information about different recipes. They have a virtual 5K that you can participate in and all kinds of different fun challenges and workshops along the way. So if you're interested in maintaining your weight, then contact the Extension Office for more information or go online and search for North Carolina Eat Smart move more, way less holiday challenge. And join us November 16th through December 31st for that campaign. This has been Jennifer Brown, Family Consumer Science Agent with the North Carolina Cooperative Extension Service. Thanks for tuning in.